Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to Ehe, the reason you see me. News right now, sources telling the Associated Press that Mayor Eric Adams has been indicted by a federal grand jury, making him the first mayor in New York City history to face an indictment. Good evening, I'm Natasha Verma. And I'm Steve Lacey. Our rumors have been swirling that this was imminent following the federal raids on the homes of members of Mayor Adams' inner circle and the wave of high-level resignations from his administration. We have live Fox 5 coverage tonight. Let's start with Morgan Mackay, who joins us now on set with this stunning development. So right now we know the indictment's coming, but we don't know for what. Mm -hmm. That's what we find out tomorrow, I guess. Exactly. Now, we know there are at least four federal investigations surrounding Mayor Eric Adams right now. But from what I'm hearing from sources is that this indictment could be tied to the federal investigation looking into whether Mayor Eric Adams accepted illegal campaign donations in part from the Turkish government. Wow. Wow. Hey, guys, check it, man. Make sure you like, subscribe to the channel. Um, man. Hey, I, I wanted to tap in on this Mayor Adams indictment, man. Things are going crazy up there, right? You know, a lot of people assumed after Diddy had got arrested that this had something to do with Diddy. It was so close in proximity. But boy, let me tell you something. Uh, they, they are naming people. Uh, this the, the judicial system has indicted Mayor Eric Adams, and it is going crazy in New York, so I had to bring my guy OG Pyru in here, Ayatollah Marv. What's going on, my brother? Man, I hear it, I hear it. It's, it's going up in New York, honey. What, man, what, I mean, New York got it going up there, man. They taking everybody to jail. Man, hey, it, it just shows, I don't care who you are, when your complexion is our skin color, everything has an expiration date. This you, dude you, is a police chief. He, he worked diligently with clear, clear people, and they got him now. What do you think going on, man? Because they, 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 they're making uh, uh, statements before statements saying that he took some money from other countries. And they're they're playing it in a certain way, like he, you know, some say he supported Trump, and this is the Biden administration's get back. What do you say to the, all of these accusations when it comes down to M Mayor Eric I mean, Adams? When when, I mean, when you look at it, you look at the indictment. What does Turkey has to do with anything? Okay, it's a it's it's an Islamic country. So now they're trying to. I guess they're dealing. He's dealing with Hezbollah. They're saying that he took. Uh, $100,000 worth of gifts and, and expenses that he flew to uh, France through Turkish Airlines. What politician don't do that? Everybody got something, but when it comes to, to black people, there's always putting extras on it. So he dealt with the Turkish government. How many other politicians don't deal with foreign governments? No, you're exactly right. Like, it, it seemed like it's they pick and choose who they want to you know, be pretty much, uh, you know, favored towards. No, they, they're going to pick and choose. They just pick black folks. <laughs> yeah. We're just, we talking about, okay, now you, you didn't indicted the mayor of New York. You was an ex-police, but you haven't indicted no other government agents that's clear people in New York. It's, I mean, it's all over the This is the first the time in history that this has happened. Uh, I mean, that's not the first time that they've indicted a mayor. I mean, they indicted uh, Kwame in Detroit. And no, no, no. I'm thinking for about in New York. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it's the first black mayor like that. So you think that that's pretty much a, one of the one of the given figures is the fact that he's a black mayor. That, and, and of course. He's, he's, he's very... Anybody else, it wouldn't even be a thought. Uh, $100,000 $100, ain't no money. Now, I think he was out at a rally in his house. I believe he got his house got searched today as well. Like, it's been a busy day. They, 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 they went in his, his, well, the Negro living good because he's living in Gracie Mansion. Mm -hmm. his, his, he, he has a Gracie Mansion in, in Manhattan. And they went through it and got his laptop and got all his electronic devices. And this is how they go get at us now. They know that we're um, pseudo-illiterate about technology so now they're they're saving grace when they start indicting you they go through electronics and claim who they could build any electronics up and clone something who said that it came out of his computer 
Well, you, 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 hey, you got a point. Like I said, they can make it whatever they want it to be. That's that's the that's the sad part about it. Whoever they decides to make the enemy, whoever they decide yeah, to make the person who's of interest, they make him who they want him to be. Anything they want in there. Correct. There's a lot of times I'm looking at a lot of these different cases where these are trumped up charges to where other people are doing things and nobody's saying nothing. But then when it comes down to people that look like you and I, they'll turn around and they'll get a harsher punishment. Or they'll bring up things that normally they wouldn't even speak on. Right. right. You know, and so when they can't get in so anything else, they got one or two things, electronics or forensic. Do you think Mayor Eric Adams... Uh, begin to think that he was above the law and bigger than you know the system itself. He thought he was above the law. He thought he was beyond being black. Oh, and that's what I was getting at. Like, do you feel like he thought he probably thought that he was untouchable? When you look, you look at his campaign. When he he ran his campaign, he ran trying to get all the police. He, he was law and order, and he didn't care anything about you know uh, uh, George Floyd. Or now, now, now he'll be rallying to blacks to help him when he never helped us. Wow, and and that's that's sad, but that's what happens a lot of times with these uh, public figures, these guys that are in office, or these guys that scale up. A lot of times they don't really pl play the part of the a African Americanism or black, you know, uh, being black. They don't pull that card until very, very necessary in the end when 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 uh people who don't look like us have turned their back on us yeah you look at oj he wasn't black since he started playing football when the trial he relied on on black people and it was pro-black soon as he got off he got another white woman look like the other white woman wow man so how do you see how do you see this playing out, man? Do you this indictment? They're supposed to unseal this indictment and start telling some specifics. What do you how do you see this playing out? Well he he, he goes to court tomorrow morning on uh, Friday. He, he's supposed to go in front of a judge Friday, a federal judge Friday, and to uh to read the indictment and more likely he's gonna uh plead not guilty. But they're gonna ruin him and make it they talking about that they'll have to do a uh, a, a primary um, re-election uh, and, and have somebody step in. But the governor, she's the governor because she played on the same ticket as him to get the black vote. Now she's stepping away, but they saying it's critical to her. If she lose him, she going to lose the black vote in New York. Wow. <coughs> it's crazy, man. Like, like, I look, I sit back and I just you know look at how how our people a start to act when they get in these positions and b what happens when they go up this big big slope of I'm better than everybody and then they get brought down the sides a lot of times man Mayor, Mayor Eric Adams you know a lot of crying going on now a lot of I man you know he's he he needs our help he needs us to stand behind him but like you said I don't know if the people are rally behind him when he wasn't really you know for the people and by the people what, what, what does he do what did he do for us while while he was there I don't think I he done he much I bet he helped everybody else but uh, Harlem uh, or Brooklyn or Queens I, I'm not there so I don't know yeah I, I got enough problems in Bompton California hey man well thank you so much man so uh, do you guys uh, uh, agree with uh, uh, OG Pyru said, what did he do when he was in office? Do you guys see uh, anything that uh, Mayor Eric Adams done? Get in the comments and let us know. Or, or do you agree with uh, OG that he, if he ain't done nothing for us, don't ask us for nothing pretty much. What you asking us for something for when you already didn't give us a, 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 a nothing when you when you had position? Uh, let us know in the comments, man. Boss Talk 101, what a boss is talk. Boss talk. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see.